Ladies and gentlemen, dear chef, and of course, chocolate lovers, welcome at the World Chocolate Masters 2018, organized by Cacao Bari. After two days filled to the brim with nerve wracking deadlines and cutting edge creations, chocolate creations, the time is now. We're having 20 finalists from 20 nations representing their country with pride, determination, craftsmanship, skills, and of course, a lot of enthusiasm. But only 10 of them will go through. Only 10 of them will be battling it out tomorrow to become the one and only World Chocolate Master 2018. I'm having here uh, the jury members, and I would really like to ask a big round of applause for those jury members. They have been doing a great job the past two days. So Frank has not Cédric uh, Grolet and uh, Naomi Mizuno, how were those two days for you? Uh, quite intense, but of course uh, a lot of tasting, beautiful work. So uh, great to be here and uh, I mean, it's very exciting two days. Can we really tell that these 20 finalists have set a bar at the highest level when we compare to other editions? Yeah, I've, I've competed myself twice. Uh, 11 years ago the first time, but you can really see every time, every edition, the level gets higher and uh, it's great to be here now and see that also this edition is get higher again. Cédric, everything is about the future, that's this edition's theme. Have you seen the future reflected? In French. Est-ce que vous avez vu le futur vraiment présent les deux derniers jours? On a vu des choses um, très... In... On a vu... It's okay. On a vu des choses très intéressantes ce, euh, pendant deux jours, des choses très futuristes, très recherchées, avec des nouvelles couleurs et de nouvelles formes. Donc je trouve ça très intéressant. A lot of new colors, techniques, shapes and uh, textures. Do you maybe have a last word for our finalists, Naomi? Something to ouais. say to them? Uh... ま、euh, de mettre en forme euh, un concept euh, qui est aussi abstrait que le futur. Hein. Mais finalement, euh, les créations, les, les candidats euh, qui ont récolté le, le nombre de points importants sont ceux qui ont réussi à le faire. Well, indeed, and it's, it's a little cliche, but being here is already a huge, huge step. We are talking about the best 20 Worldwide chef, so please give them again a big round of applause. And then, Frank, the question is, are you ready for it? I think I'm ready for it, yeah. Let's do it. Because we are having the results over here in the envelopes. But first, maybe let me take you back in time. We had two thrilling day, exciting days, and we have captured the most precious and special moments in a little video recap. An extraordinary piece. Well, if it stands at the end, I will be happy. <laughs>
it. Well, ladies and gentlemen, here they are. The first one from China, Jing Jing Liao. Russia, Artem Glushkov. La France, Joanne Laval. Mexico, Alejandro Salas. Australia, Daria Nechiporenko. Morocco, Yassine Lamjad. Poland, Michel Ivaniuk. Germany, Martin Stoney. Spain, Ivan Pasqual. Italy, Maurizio Fro. UK, Barry Johnson. Korea, Unyu Kip. Switzerland, Elias Ladera. Singapore, Desmond Lee. United Arab Emirates, Aravin Lalina Hatna. From Denmark, Thor Stuber. Belgium, Jürgen Bart. Japan, Akihiro Kakimoto. And USA, Florent Chevaux. So Frank, I hope you are ready. What will be do will be be doing? You, we will invite some people to come and join us, and you will read exactly the remarks the of the jury. So let's start with the first envelope. The countries we would like to invite. The first one is Russia. Artem. Second country, Japan. Third country, Poland. And fourth country, Germany. So it's up to you, Frank, reading okay, the we quotes. Have, we have a few comments from our, uh, our judging panel. Uh, for Russia, we start with Russia. Uh, the snack on the go, the concept of the day was spot on. Uh, great taste, easy to eat, nice packaging. Lactose-free, future-proof, fantastic, tasty concept. Yet perfection was missing today. Uh, also, it was missing uh, on the execution yesterday as well of the QR tablet uh, concept of the day. So, is this snack going to save you today? Let's have a look. Next, Japan. Yesterday, top three. Today, artistically the best. Or now our tablet concept. Akira. Akihiro snack on the go, daring, outside of the box, definitely in a competition risk taking can be awarded, but will it be enough? Poland, Michael, after a very good score of the chocolate showpiece yesterday, how did Michael do today? For the Ornoatas, the round shape of Michael's tablet stood out. Positive comments from the jury of the packaging on a snack to go. Will it be enough? to get him to a place in the top 10. Germany, Martin. Mixed comments from the jury. Today they saw a beautiful snack to go on the box. They saw a beautiful snack to go on the box, but how do we eat your concept on the go? High complexity of flavors on your chocolate tablet, balanced yet challenging for the taste buds. Have a look. Yes, all right. Thank you very much, uh, Frank. And it's with pain in my heart because I know that mm -hmm. 10 of you will be leaving. But please keep in mind that you are among the creme de la creme, the 20 best worldwide. So I hope you're ready for the results. We'll start with Russia. Unfortunately, we will have to say goodbye. You're not through. Give him a big round of applause, please. The second one is Japan. 
We'll see each other back tomorrow. Congratulations. Poland, as they say, gemeint in German, Chuki, but congratulations, you're going through. And then for Germany, I like working a lot with you, but unfortunately we have to say goodbye. Congratulations, Otto. Then I will be taking the second envelope and the countries we are inviting are the Netherlands, China, USA and Mexico. Frank, up to you, the All quote right. from the jury. We start off with the Netherlands, Patrick. Your today's concept of the freshly steamed chocolate bomb was very appreciated. The rack links to street food, good fit for a snack on the go challenge. Unfortunately, some critical notes as well from the jury on your overall performance. A pity that you could not deliver on time for some assignments. Let's see what the jury has to say. China. The jury liked today's snacks to go on uh, concept. Edible packaging, nice touch of Szechuan pepper, well balanced. Let's have a look. Florent, USA. Today Florent presented a nicely designed tablet uh, representing a shape of DNA. Hence future proof, a signature chocolate and very nice signature presentation. We also saw and tasted some next generation donut. Luscious looks, fantastic taste. During this competition, you showed off your talent and skills and beautiful designs. Mexico, Alejandro. Mexican in heart and soul. Great, you made a choice to include Mexican cocoa beans in your Ornoir recipe. Very nice approach to the concept as well, save the bees, both reflecting the honeycomb shape and the use of the ingredients. The jury will remember as well the city of the future chocolate show piece. Curious if this will make you to the next round. Thank you. Well, exciting and the future, I think for them, the most important is the new future tomorrow. So who's going through day three of this competition? I can already reveal that only one person of your group will make it to Friday, tomorrow, here at Salon du Chocolat. And the person we'll be seeing back tomorrow Florent Chevaux from USA! Congratulations, Alejandro, Ying Liar, and Patrick. It was really great having you here. And keep up the good work. For our next group, please step forward. France. Denmark. Australia, Spain, and UK. All right, we're going to start with French, Joan. Yesterday you did a great performance, but will today will be enough to keep this uh, performance standing? The jury rated this Ornoir tablet as very elegant. Uh, the snack on the go of Yuan, nice flavor pairings, well done. Will you stay in the top favorites of the competition? Denmark, Thor. Thor offered the jury today a chocolate and a chocolate tablet with a story of, from his heart. Thor gave his signature chocolate the name of his daughter and combined his chocolate with fresh elderly elderflower flavor. All Thor creations clearly reflect the choice for natural fresh ingredients. Thor on the go concept tastes a great Danish happy street food snack served with a free great smile of, of Chef Thor. Good luck with this course. Daria Australia. Daria presented today a snack to go to be served directly from the food truck. 
very pleasant smell, contemporary, great choice for to-go and less sugar approach. Daria showed a nice wave-shaped tablet. A pity technical execution was poor. How will this, uh, uh, this affect Daria's overall choice score? All right. Spain, Ivan. Lovely that Spanish local flavors and ingredients consistently came back in Ivan's creations. He is clearly bringing new flavors of Spain into the World Chocolate Masters. The jury liked the Gavet concept, refined, very comfortable to eat on the go. Combined with his good performance on the chocolate showpiece, curious how Ivan will do in his ranking. Last but not least, Barry from the United Kingdom. Barry is determined in his choices for allergy-free and clean, clear, responsible, both in his travel cake yesterday as well as today's Ornoir chocolate. 100% organic, all clear and conscious future choices. The vegan waffle cone with the local strawberries combined with the cocoa juice based sorbet showed again that Barry is a champion of the thought of health conscious and gluten free creations. Did the entire jury appreci appreciate his healthy choices? All right. Whew, I think I can feel the heartbeat <laughs> from there over here. So maybe let's start with the country that is uh, inviting us and having us France, La Douce of France. Was it enough? It was. Congratulations, Juan. <laughs> Thor from Denmark. I, know, I think we know each other a little better now. <laughs> so, am I having good news or bad news? You're going through. Congratulations. <laughs> Daria, delighted to work with some ladies in this team, so congratulations for that. I really would like to hope to see you smile again, but unfortunately, we are saying goodbye here. Spain, you two have been talking a lot <laughs> and I was really amused by your creativity and I won't see that tomorrow anymore, so sorry. <laughs> and then our fifth country in this group, enough talking, you're going through. In the fourth envelope, I'm inviting the countries Switzerland, Korea, and Belgium. Okay, Switzerland. You were as sharp as a knife, precise as a Swiss clock. Elias continued his good performance of yesterday with an excellent technical execution of the Or Noir tablet challenge. Moreover, the jury discovered as well that the Swiss version of the bento box, excellent design packaging with a cold snack, a crunchy snack and a drink. Very well done. Korea. The jury comment of your Or Noir tablet concept, delicate, elegant, subtle, great texture, Eucalyptus perfectly dosed, harmonious, very good. Congratulations from the jury on, for the stunning presentation on your snack. The ma manga leaf and the little recipe card, the seed plant, very pure, organic, refined and very beautiful. You definitely stepped up as you went further in the competition. Let's see if it will be enough. Belgium, Jürgen. Today the jury tasted your waffle, a Belgium iconic. Lovely that your Belgium contestant, lovely that the Belgium contestant has chosen to present this. Nice to see a consistent work of you 
and let's see if the on the word on the water world will be enough to bring it to the next round. A lot of uh, quotes and comments, yeah. but it's necessary to know what the jury is taking into account and really difficult sending one or more home. Okay. Here we go. I hope the supporters are ready. Let's start with... Oh, congratulations! Then we can start counting, so we would like to invite Morocco. Italy. United Arab Emirates. And Singapore. Okay, Yassin, Morocco. Ornoir is about personal choices. This was nice when you reflected in Yassine's creation. Yassine created a dark milk chocolate reflecting his personal taste. Gorgeous snack to go packaging and great to have you here for the first time on the World Chocolate Masters. Also very nice to see how you stay calm during the entire competition in good and in bad moments. Your soapies started off very promising, then you had a crash. But you rescued it, rescued it very well done. Maurizio, Italy. Your tablet, tangerine, hazelnut. Welcome back, flavors out of, it, out of Italy. For the to-go, uh, for the to-go challenge, futuristic idea to have 3D printing packaging, yet it is a snack to go and it have to eat on the go. Overall, the jury appreciated you went local for your choices of ingredients in your creations. Let's see if it's gonna be enough. UAE, Aravinda. Nice you paired your bespoke chocolate with Asian spices and flavors. Lovely idea to combine the snack with a drink on the go, different textures and flavors, tasty executions. It was so sophisticated. Too boutique to be a snack to go. The jury noticed your consistent performance throughout the competition. Singapore, Desmond. Will Desmond manage to enter the top 10? For sure the jury appreciated today, today that he went for a less sweet, more salty approach on the snack to go. Let's see him wait. Thank you. Well, thank you, especially for all the good work you're four of you have been doing the past two days. So for those who are counting, there's only one place left. So, who are we dating tomorrow morning? I know. <laughs> only one country can go through. And that country is, or that person is, That place goes to Desmond Lee from Singapore. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, our 10 super finalists for tomorrow, they will have to convince the judges with skills, creativity and ideas about the future of chocolate patisserie snacks bonbons and so much more. I would like also to ask an amazing round of applause for the 10 finalists who left us. Please give them a huge big round of applause. So 
ladies and gentlemen, those are the 10 super finalists and we will be see them tomorrow working on other uh, chocolate creations and other creativity. So stay tuned because tomorrow sharp 10 a.m. we will start again and battle it out for the World Chocolate Master 2018. And you must know that with a World Chocolate Master comes an amount, an amazing prize package. So let's have a quick look at what our master will win. is here with our two super finalists so see you back tomorrow at 10 a.m. CET join us on Facebook Twitter Instagram Pinterest by the hashtag WCM Futropolis and of course on www.worldchocolatemasters.com don't forget to vote on your favorite chocolate showpiece and give your favorite chef the public award for showpiece time to say goodbye sweet chocolate dreams see you tomorrow bye bye